you are watching at just a fraction of the expected attendees for this annual Teach Them Young Easy Swim Camp. Age 6 to 16, the participants will undergo learning the life skill of swimming under the guidance of trained coaches, one of whom is Paul Mahaika. Our goal is to teach them young, so not only that they will be competitive swimmers, that one of the main things is for them to learn a life skill. And we're going to be start with basic elementary. We're going to be teaching them how to do streamline position, how to kick properly, how to glide, and the different um, introducing front crawl to them. So our plan is for kids to learn to swim and try as much as possible to eliminate drowning. Because we have here, right here, children who are athletes, I should say, who are volunteering now for this program who also come up from in within this same um, program who now who artists who represent us at Olympics, artists who represent us at World Championships who come through this program. So this program is very, very vital for the competitive swimmer swimming in Guyana. The numbers I'm seeing here today tells me a lot about the interest in the sport. It says a lot about where we can go. It's now on us to harness this interest and to make these youngsters into potential uh, national athletes. NSC Commissioner Christy Campbell revealed that this camp is just a start as the National Swim Academy will soon be launched. I want you to know that when this program concludes, it's not the end of our support to swimming and developing your talent. Because in another few weeks, we are also preparing to launch the National Swimming Academy, which is fully funded by the Ministry of Culture, Youth and Sport through the National Sports Commission. So you can look forward to continue, continuity in our support to swimming. There will also come in Lynn and Watuka Guest House Swimming Pool and in Burbies at Albion Estate Swimming Pool. The program is expected to conclude on April 22nd. For the newsroom, Akin Green.